Well, this is Pat Walker, Mission Winners. I'm doing a training coaching video for everybody. The idea here in the foundation is this, not, oh, wow, these are all great stocks. No, th you can find great stocks, but the goal is this, to explain and show why they were bought, why they were bought. Foundations, if you have those foundations, then you can transfer it to your potential stocks and see, ah, now I see what to look for. And this is what we do at Mission Winners. Not just give ideas, but explain why. I love teaching. I love helping. And this is what I always tell people. To know that 2 plus 2 equal 4 is knowledge, but to know why 2 plus 2 equal 4 is knowledge that's transferable to other situations. That's power. So that's what we do. That's what I love doing on Mission Winners is explaining why. Then it helps you in your search quest. So let's go through and look at some of these. We're looking at Google. Google broke through this spot right here. By the way, all these were keyless stocks. I can document it. Every one of these was a keyless stock for a buy. This is not after the fact, before. Picked up right there, pushing right through that level. You can say, what's so special about this? Well, I'll tell you this. This says it all. It is a maxless stock, and relative strength was extremely strong when we bought it. And it had volume, and it had a clean and simple base right there. Right there, pushing through 2120, and here it is at 2350. And some was sold up here just before earnings. I mean, team, that's what you're looking for. That's what we're after, folks. So that's what we do. Here's another stock for you. We're just going to go through and look at some of these, okay? This one right here, STLD. You can say, well, what's so special about you buying this, Pat? I will tell you, when we bought it right here, the group rank was A+. Now, you could say, oh, you're talking about now? No, I'm going back before we bought it. All right, group rank A plus, composite rating 99, relative strength extremely strong. When we bought this stock, earnings were up 139%, sales up 38%, relative strength extremely strong. It was in the top 10 groups right there. That's 10 points real quick, folks. That's what you're after. And note this though, it's a clean and simple base with a volume surge. That's what you're looking for. Find those and you're light years ahead. Here's another one. Look at that base. It's a clean and simple flat base. I say this a lot and I can't stress this. Focus on patterns that everybody can see. Why? If other people see what you see, does it not increase the odds that they will buy also? Sure it does. Isn't that what you want? And how will that be measured? Two different ways. Good price move combined with volume. Look at the buy right there. That was nice. Now, what's special about this one? The earnings were only up 14% and sales only up 9% when we bought this right here. But it was in the top 10 groups when we bought it. It has a composite rating of 95, relative strength 99 when we're buying it. You can't get better than that. Accumulation distribution A minus. I mean, and look at the volume. Clean and simple base. And I'll do this for you to help you. There it is. A lot of people look at charts after the fact. It's better to look at them before they break out to train your eyes and mind on what to look for. Just clean tops going across this spot. Nothing fancy. You advance it. Oh, gee, look at what it does. There you go. That's simple. Isn't that nice? We like that. Right? I think it's really good at least. Let's do another one. What do you say? Rio, right there. Right there. Look at the dang volume. You can say, well, what was special about Rio when you bought it? Earnings per share rate, 94. Composite rating, 98. Accumulation distribution, B. Earnings up, excuse me, relative strength, 84. Earnings, earnings up 43%. I always tell people this is a fact, not an opinion. Stocks that have earnings up 40% or higher and or, doesn't need to be off, average sales for two quarters up 40% or higher, normally are winners. And remember to talk about volume? Look at the volume surge when they bought it. That's a good start. And what is this? This company handle formation. Again, composite rating 98. That's what we like. FCX, entry right here. Folks, look at the volume. Watch this. What do you have here? You've got a cup with a high handle. You can say, oh, that's a red bar. There's no selling on that bar. This bar, there's no selling on that bar. Starts to pick up. Look at the buying volume. The next bar starts to pick up. You say, I guess if it goes across these tops, it would be really good. 
And guess what? It did. That's sweet potato pie. Look at the volume on that bar. Ready? You'll love this. Earnings up 419% when we bought it. Sales up 73% when we bought it. Relative strength 97 when we bought it. Composite rating 99 when we bought it. That's how you build a case. GS, look at that base. Lifting through here and it starts to run. That's beautiful. You can say, what's special about GS? Oh, let's see here. Earnings up 498%, 498. Sales up 58%. Composite rating 99, group rank A minus, relative strength strong, volume surge lifting through here, clean and simple base. Oh, and yes, it is a max list stock. That's how we build a case. And it works. Here's the next one for you. Denberry, entry right there. Look at that volume pickup, folks. Watch this, I'll make it easy for you. He's just going across these tops. You could even make the line longer right through the... See that line right there going across it? Look at the volume. Look at the volume pickup. You can say, well, tell me, and then it does this. That's a good move, folks. That's a good start. Look at the volume Friday. Oh, what was going on with this stock? Well, they just reported earnings this week. However, what were their earnings before when we bought it? First off, earnings per share rate 97 Composite rating, 99. Relative strength, 98. Group rank, A plus when we bought it. That's how you build a case. Turn off the noise. Look for the special stuff. Make it easy. Here's the next one for you. EOG. Right there. Picked up Friday. See that? Look at the volume. Look at the volume on this bar. Look at this base. Nice long base. You could draw that with a crayon, but I encourage you not to do that on your computer screens. Just messes up the screen, okay? Just kidding. You got to have a little fun too. Look at the volume pickup on this. A plus group, accumulation distribution, A minus, composite rating 96 when we bought it. 96. Oh, um, yeah, last quarter's earnings up 195%. Right in here they report it. I don't know about you, but I think that's a really good start. Home Depot. Look at the base right here. Isn't this nice? Look at this move. Earnings per share rate 90, okay? Earnings per share rate 90. Composite rating currently is 89. It was 89 or 90 when we bought it. I mean, look at the volume on that bar. Look at this, folks. It's going sideways. Watch this. Okay, just kind of going sideways. I see it's picking up a little bit. Maybe it'll go across the tops. I don't know. If it does, maybe we'll buy some. Okay, yeah, I can see those tops. I got a top here near it there. Okay, that looks okay, I guess. Oh, gee whiz. Oh, my. Look at the volume. Here's the tops. Gosh, if it goes above that white line, maybe that would be good. Oh, do you think they voted? Folks, on this bar, the stock did 4.8 million shares. On this bar, 13.7 million shares. There you go. It's a Dow stock. And I don't know about you, but this, there you go. That's a good move. We'll just call it 290 to 3, right up here, 339. Look at the trend. Isn't that what you want? There you go. Now you've built a case. Now you've built a case. Next stock on the list, Nucor. Look at this top. You say earnings per share rank 91, group rank A+, plus. accumulation distribution A+. Plus. All these things were super high when we bought it, folks. Okay. Composite rating 99. Um, last quarter's earnings up are you ready? Are you sitting down? Even if you're standing up, you'll still like it. Up 213%. Isn't that what you want? Relative strength really strong when it pushed through. Look at the volume picks up. Heavy volume on this bar. And you could say, this isn't a really good bar. Actually, it is. It closed down just a hair from the previous day's close, and it closed in the top half of its range. That's good. And look at the lift. Is that... And you know what that's called? That's sweet potato pie right there. 83 to 99 in a week? That's just the start. And yeah, we sold any? Nope. Nope. Let her work. See what happens. Here's the next one for you. PDCE. Right here. Look at that base. Going across these tops right here. I'll, there's the line. See the line going across there? Right there. Look at the volume pickup. 
Group rank A+, plus. accumulation distribution A, composite rating 90, relative strength 97. And folks, this is what we were looking at when we bought it. Oh gosh, how were the earnings this quarter? They just reported this week, just before it broke out. Oh, earnings were up 117%. By the way, that 30% M, what does that mean? We bought more, bought it and bought more. There you go, through those tops. Look at the volume. That's what we're after. This one right here. This was on the key list this week. Look at the tops here. Look at the volume on this bar. Even this bar didn't close that bad. Just going across these cleans and simple tops, all right? Group rank A plus, accumulation distribution A minus, composite rating 99, and folks, composite rating 99, that's what we were looking at before we bought it. Relative strength 98, all right? There you go. And again, composite rating 99. Earnings just came out. That was a catalyst here. Earnings up 400%. The previous quarter, earnings up 117%. Look at the move. Look at the volume on this bar. You know what they did, folks? Yeah, they voted. They voted. Here we go. One more. SBLK, right there. Look at the buy. Look at the volume on this bar. The stock did, you ready? 646,000 shares on this bar. 1.78 million? Look at the lift. Isn't that nice? Earnings were down 17%. All right? You can say, whoa. What caught our eyes here? Sales were down 25%, but the stock has a composite rating of 87, had a high composite rating. Relative strength is 98. Relative strength was in the upper 90s when we bought it, okay? And here's the best part. Group rank A+. Plus. Remember, focus on stocks in the top 10 groups. You'd like great numbers, but stocks in the top 10 groups get a pass, all right? as long as the chart is great. Oh, and by the way, hmm, gosh, I wonder what their estimates are for this year. Oh yeah, their estimates are, are you ready? This year they're anticipated, analysts expect their earnings to go up 999%. See how we build the case? There you go. Putting all the pieces of the puzzle together and it works. Yeti, right there. Look at the breakout. Clean and simple. Off to the races. Earnings per share rank 78. Okay. Group rank is B. Still good. SMRA, accumulation distribution, B minus, composite rating 93. Oh, um, yeah, let's not forget. Rel relative strength is 90. And um, earnings last quarter were up 72%. It makes the cut. And relative strength was leading the stock into new high ground when it broke through these spots. And look at the volume on that bar. That's a nice start there, folks. That's a nice start. Thank you for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit like. Maybe hit that subscribe button. We come up with new content nearly every day. Also, check out the videos on the right. YouTube recommends the one on the top, and the bottom one is something we thought you might enjoy. See you next time.